All right, welcome back, my dear student. So the next, this lecture is super easy. We're gonna add a button here that will close this box whenever we want. So that way, this this thing is never, it's not open all the time. All right, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's go all the way to the top, and right here, we're gonna, and we're in process that PHP, by the way. Let's just go call this button close. I don't know if that's a Bootstrap class. I haven't used it, but that's it. All right, and if you go all the way to the bottom here, we don't need to actually write all that if we don't want to. There's a, a whole bunch of different ways that we can do this, but we can even attach it to the same button. Close button, there we go. And all I need here, to be honest, is just this click event here. Tag right here, and we can remove it from the DOM if we wanted to with a function, but we can also hide it. So, btn close is the ID. So, let's check it out real quick to see if it works. All right, we need to take this word hello out of there. Ah, it says delete, but anyway, it's this button right here. We, cl we click it and it's closed. All right, so close. There we go. What else? Oh, the hello word right here. Beautiful. All right. Beautiful, beautiful. Click it, gone. There we go, actually. Working beautiful, guys. Working beautiful. Update. Record was updated. Beautiful. And we can go to Ferrari's, update it as well. On the fly, we can search our database for, for that specific Honda. We can add it. Lamborghini. I think that's how you spell it. Maybe not. Add it. There we go. You can select it from here and delete it. There we go. Of course, we might want to work on this here because um, it's actually being shown right now. But we can take that off and fix it. All right. Anyway, I'm not going to work on that right now. I'll work on the, on that on the next lectures. All right. Meanwhile, um, just remove this once you you uh, show it. That should be easy. Or when you actually close it down, you can remove it. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and on the next lectures and hopefully I'll, I'll make some other lectures and make more uh, this more advanced. But by by now, this course is finished. Uh, you know, I did what I promised. The cross functionality is here and whatever comes after this is really, really, really extra lectures that I haven't even promised you yet. All right. I just say I might make some more extra, extra lectures and I like doing that to all my courses. Thank you so much for the support. If you're happy with the course, don't forget to give me some reviews. I love seeing my students reviewing my course. And again, it's a pleasure. And I'll see you in the next lectures or courses. Take care.